this one to turn it on, take mm -hmm. both arrows, hit them at the same time, the lights up green. Mm -hmm. I, when, I, when I do it, and that's how I did this one, then I hit auto level, I let it do its thing. Um, it has a retract all. Again, I wouldn't do that because that's your front ones. Mm -hmm. If you get ready to leave and you need to get hooked up, hit hitch height. Mm -hmm. That brings up all four rear jacks and it resets the front where it was when you hit auto level. Oh, so just so you hit this? Correct. So if you hit hitch height, it's going to bring up the rear four jacks mm -hmm. and it's going to adjust the front to where it was before you hit auto level. Oh, okay. Generator's here, battery is here. I put a brand new battery in it. The reason why I did is they from the factory that come with a battery, mm -hmm. but they're cheap and they're small. And this one had been sitting here long enough. If you don't have enough juice in this battery, it won't level. And it's it's pretty demanding. If it, I mean, if it's down to like 12, one or 11, nine, somewhere like that, the auto levelers won't work. Everything else will work, yeah. but the auto levelers won't. So it's got a brand new interstate battery in it. It's the bigger of the two. It's the 27 series. It had a 24 in it. Ah, you familiar with generators? Yeah. Okay, so press and hold to prime. Actually, I actually ran it once this morning on too. Press and hold to start. And then breakers I currently have off. Um, I don't like to have them on when I start it, just in case. Never want to start a generator load on it. Oh, okay. So but, you recommend every time put that on? I do. Well, the best scenario I've come up with to explain it to folks is say you're 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 camping somewhere and it's hot outside and you've got the air conditioners all running mm -hmm. and the park loses power. Mm -hmm. Oh well, I've got a generator. I just got to start my generator up and I can run one or two of my air conditioners. Mm -hmm. Well, a good idea to to turn your air conditioners off. So it's not immediately trying to pull a load off this when it starts. Mm -hmm. um, also, you have a built-in safety item in your transfer switch. So your automatic transfer switch, whether it's power coming in from shore power or from here, it doesn't allow both to come in together. So it, it, it's, it's built so it doesn't start a fire that way. Yeah. However, I'm on the cautious side. I like to unplug, then start it. Um, that's just me. And then, uh, of course, let it run for a second. Kind of let it idle where it needs to. Then you can turn, turn those on and you're good to go there. 